Good morning, everybody. It's uh, 6 11 a.m. Friday, March 16th, 2012. Um, I just woke up. Uh, they had to change the IV site from here to there, and me being fat, naturally my veins roll. So that's what they did, and uh, hopefully, that this new one here will work. Um, they got to take this one out. Sorry about the blood that's in it. Mm. Woke up this morning and was tired. They unhooked me. No. No go having to take number two. Is that better? Number two. Um, plenty of number one. They said my blood sugar was through the roof. But that's amazing. I haven't been eating anything or nothing like that. So then they looked at the water and they said, well, the water is kind of, has dextrose in it. That's kind of a sugar, isn't it? They said, oh, yeah. Well, they're going to find out what's going on. Uh, what it is, I'm so big. You know, I'm 443 pounds. They said, now that, let me move this down. So. There we go. That um, they're worried about cutting me open because there's no muscle in the stomach area, guys. Remember? Yeah. Remember in this area, there's no muscle in there. They're worried about it because they said the body is pressurized and you know, something can go wrong and they don't want anything to go wrong to me. And I said, just do it if you have to. If something happens, it happens. They don't like my motto, the one from the old Star Trek days, you know, uh, it's a good day to die. Remember the Klingons used to say that? You know, nobody wants to die, but you know, if things have to be done, they have to be done, right? Sorry guys, this is a Logitech older cam, it's not an HD. So I'm sorry about that. Um, thank you, Michelle. Thank you, Harry. Um, everyone I know by their names for all the comments and stuff. And I, I love the one person that says, I'm trying, I'm faking this. Okay, if I'm on federal disability, how can I afford props like this? You know, how can I afford props like this? You know, if that's the case, I wouldn't be wasting my time. All right, I come in here and go in the hospital and let you guys know what's going on with me. I let people know that care, people who want to know, people who are curious. You know, the haters can hate all they want. But there's a little button on here, it's called blocking. And I've blocked a lot of haters. And I do mean a lot of haters. The only thing I kind of miss right now is that I cannot go to uh, Nappy Jay's and Care Bear's um, wedding on the 7th on the 17th which is uh, St. Patrick's Day in Fulon I really wanted to go won't be able to miss meet the other juggalos and juggalettes um, you know I like to meet people ones we consider fam um, it's hard and San Bernardino sorry guys I can see my eyebrows are messed up to find juggalos and juggalettes that are upper higher in my age at least in their 20s you got the younger ones yes but I'm not, no offense I'm not gonna hang out with the real young ones no I don't want to be known as that guy um, my throat's dry they still won't give me any food or water so it's still no food or water for the fat man that's what cracks me up my sugar is still way that high um, um, I might be on stick cam for a while talking to a few people otherwise uh, this computer does not have world of tanks on it I can't play it so I don't know what to go from there and uh, so I gotta check on that find something to do I don't want to blow up my channel with a bunch of videos from me from the hospital but people said they want to know so I figure if I do one now at 615 so I figure about 915 or 1015 I might make another one letting you guys know how I'm doing you know and just do it like every three hours or so uh, excuse me that was a nice one though um, Otherwise, like I said, just in the hospital, watch the TV up there. I sit here, wait to be 
probed or poked or more blood again or or something. I mean, they tried to poke this hand. It didn't work. Wish it did, though. Take it a whole lot easier. I'm being poked with these weird needles again. Anyway, people out there, I'm staying positive. I'm staying strong. I'm staying happy. Haters only make you famous. If you want to hate on me, that's fine. But when you start getting derogatory toward other people on my channel just for the hell of it, you're blocked. I've already blocked some chat room haters. So the other, that one chat room hater went to my other page on my other YouTube. What he do? He got blocked from there too. Then someone I didn't expect who was in the chat room just just made a comment on there just for the hell of it. I haven't heard from him in a while. I came on, just went yawn. Okay, so what I have to do? I got to block him. Didn't want to. But the point is, why make a comment like that? There's no need need for it. You know, out of the blue, you're gonna go ahead and do this. So everyone, I wish a good life out there. Be well. Take care. Much clown love. And uh, if you believe in God, believe in God. If not, believe in something that makes you strong. All right? Take care. Be well. And bless you, okay? Peace.